Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I came up with this look for you guys. Um, the only theme I had for myself was the color yellow. So I went ahead and pulled out every palette that I had in my collection with the shade yellow and wanted to see what I could come up with and this is the outcome. And I am honestly obsessed with it. I wasn't sure halfway through, but um... I'm pretty happy. If you like to see how I achieve this, just keep on watching. First thing I'm doing is filling in my eyebrows lightly with the Maybelline Expert Brow Pencil in the shade Blonde. Then you like to brush it out with any spoolie just to make sure you're moving around all that product you placed and so it doesn't get stuck in one area. My number one advice for eyebrows is always cleaning them up with concealer and any concealer will do. That will make them look perfect and fix any mistakes you made while filling them in with your product. And the last step is just setting it with any eyebrow gel, whether it's clear or tinted. First shade I'm using is from the Zulu palette. In from the Juvia's place, I'm sorry. Um, putting that in my crease and blending it out with the shade Spear from the Anastasia Beverly Hills Prism Palette. And you want to pack it on and keep packing it on and blending it until it's perfect. To cut my crease, I use the NYX Full Coverage Concealer in the, the shade Alabaster. It's the lightest shade that I had and it was perfect to Use for this look using the shade banana split from the dose of colors ice cream palette I set my concealer using the shade blur from the prism palette I'm just darkening and deepening the outer V of my eye I always go back and fix everything and add any more eyeshadow if I need for extra pigment and just to top it off, using some really bright highlight colored glitter. Just for a little something extra. Using the Pore Professional Primer from Benefit. Just applying that to my cheek areas and spraying my face with the Quick Fix Primer from Urban Decay. one of my favorite foundations ever to use for a full coverage look because it is extremely buildable, buildable and long wearing and it is the Wet n Wild Photo Focus Foundation. Blending out with a beauty blender and always make sure it's damp while blending. To go along with the rest, I'm using Photo Focus Concealer, using it under my eyes and to highlight the rest of my face. And I am setting that with the Maybelline Fit Me Powder. This stuff is amazing and cheap and you need it in your life in the shade 10. This one has more of a yellow undertone and it really helps neutralize and brighten my face at the same time. Using a large fluffy brush, I'm just going to use the rest of the powder to set the rest of my face and also brush away the, any excess that we have left from baking. Using the Morphe Continuous Setting Mist, we're just going to blend all of that powder we put on together and give us a smooth base. For my under eye, I am just bringing Lure down and contouring and highlighting my face with the Kat Von D Shade and Light Palette. This is a always go-to palette to bronze, contour, and highlight.
Primer Blush. I'm using the Milani Baked Blush in the shade Luminoso. This is one of my favorite peach blushes to use. It's glowy and matte at the same time. For highlight, I'm using Gilded Glow. I'm sorry, Gilded Gold by Laura Geller and it is one of the most beautiful golds that I have that actually look like glass. And to top that off, I'm using Champagne Pop that Jaclyn Hill came out with Becca Cosmetics a couple years ago. Putting that on all high points of my cheeks, inner corners, brow bone, and also the bridge of my nose and the tip. To line my lips, I'm using the NYX lip liner in the shade Natural, and that is one of my favorites to overline with. It is the perfect lip color but better lip liner. Right on top, I'm applying Nudie Patootie by Wet n Wild from their Liquid Katsu Liquid Lipstick line. I'm using the Air Control Hairspray by Aveda and making sure all those little baby hairs and flyaways are smoothed down. I hope you enjoyed this bright summer look and I will see you in my next video.